Okay, so I'm back out here busking again. I'm in Vevey, Switzerland, and um, this is the first time busking in a while. I was kind of stuck at home and just working on my online stuff, but um, I'm here again, and uh, it is a bit different now. They have some new measures. Um, they recommend wearing the masks in the streets too. A lot of people are doing it, so I don't know. I did a set in that uh, spooky tunnel where the acoustic is good, so yeah, the vibe is just kind of weird. Uh, it feels like everybody's afraid, so it's not the best place to busk right now. So let's see. So this is another good spot that I usually play at. It's next to a mall. And what I try to do is to put the basket for the money as far away from me as possible so people don't have to come close to do like a socially distanced busking setup. So as you can hear, the street is pretty loud. It kind of sucks because I'm not allowed to amplify my harp, but it works for me so far. Usually people are still coming close enough to be able to hear it. So now it's time for a break. I usually go use the bathroom in the mall and it's also time to refill my bottle because I get so so thirsty when I sing all the time. So yeah, time for a little refill, a little break and then I usually go to another spot. So I did another set, um, it was okay, not great, not terrible I guess, uh, and I also bought some CDs because I'm running out, I only have one left. I'm gonna have to burn some new CDs, and now I'm gonna do a last set at the tunnel, let's see how it goes. Yeah, it's okay, it's actually not as bad as I thought. at that tunnel for about 20 minutes maybe and then that guy that reggae guy came and wanted to play so I let him play um, and I went back to the mall where it was really loud but I did sell I did sell my last CD and uh, so it's not too bad and actually it's nice to busk because I get to practice songs that I don't usually play that much if I'm just practicing at home so that's always good so the good thing about Vevey is it's actually a small town so there's not too much paranoia like you would have in uh, bigger cities so it's, uh, it's still pretty chill. Now I've got one last thing to do. Um, I'm gonna try and get my money on my account. There is a machine at the back but it's broken most of the time so let's cross fingers and see. Hallelujah, it looks like the machine is working. So basically what this machine does is that it reads your card, then you put your coins in this compartment and then the machine counts the coins and puts all the money on your account. It's so convenient. So I'm very happy that the machine is working again because it wasn't working for like months and so I ended up having kilos of cash of just coins laying around. So it's nice to know it's working again. Uh, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my train back home and that will be a day <laughs> back home. Ooh, that 
was a long day, that was a really long day, but nice to be back busking, um, nothing majorly interesting happened today, but let's see if I can, if I managed to make a somewhat interesting video out of the, the footage that I got, but yeah, um, it seems like Switzerland is not doing another lockdown anytime soon, um, but I don't know. I don't watch the news. I just I just take it day by day. It's always worse in the news than it is in real life. But it, it's okay. It's okay. And um, I'm I'm doing everything I can to um, stay safe. I'm doing the socially distant um, busking setup. Wearing the mask is not mandatory, so I don't wear it. But if I see if people come up close to me and want to talk, and they are wearing the mask, then I'll. I'll wear it too because, you know, um, I want to be respectful um, to people. Also in Vevey, in that town, there's a lot of elderly people, so I, I want to I wanna really try and be as respectful to them as I can. I think if they make the mask mandatory, I'm not gonna go busking because singing with a mask on is, is, is a pain in the ass, so <laughs> not gonna do that. So, depending on the weather, I, I might go back busking. I probably will because it's, it's nice to kind of be outside and not be stuck at home um, on my on my phone or my laptop. It's nice to be outside and also I, I see that people appreciate it. So that, you know, that makes me also very happy that I can make people happy somehow because they, they miss music, they miss live music. It's really nice to see, you know, when, when you play in the streets and people like your stuff. There There's really nothing like it, you know, and um, it kind of makes it all worth it, you know. <laughs> so... I'm gonna go sleep. I, I walked uh, 15 kilometers yesterday and I was at my sister's place and she has kittens and they woke me up all night so I don't mind it though. <laughs> but anyway, I'm gonna go and uh, have a good night's sleep. Yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye! <laughs>